You can also draw in the velocities for an entire passage. Start by clicking on the vertical bar of the first note and then drag while holding the mouse down across the vertical bars for the rest of the notes. As you move your pointer across the vertical bars, the velocities will be adjusted according to where your mouse crosses. This is useful for creating expressive curves. If you want to adjust more than just the velocity, or if you want more precise control, the playback panel in the properties window will allow you to make further changes to the live playback data. Let's click on the first note of the trumpet part in measure six. Go to the playback panel in the properties window. Live velocity refers to the volume and it uses standard MIDI values, which means that 127 is the loudest, zero is the softest. Let's turn the live velocity on and change it to 127 and then play back by hitting the P key. Now, turn it to zero and play again. This time, you won't hear the note at all.